Let's see, does this look better? Does this look better? Yeah, we'll go with that. What's going on guys? This is Burrs. I want to talk to you today about battle ready holsters. There's tons of different Kydex out there. You've seen over the years where I've showed you tons of different companies that have done Kydex holsters uh, from the East Coast to the West Coast, all the way across the country. And uh, here's another co uh, company who's doing some good work, smaller business. And that's what we're gonna talk about today. You know, I'm the kind of person that likes to buy quality. Unfortunately, when it comes to Kydex and you're looking online, you, you really cannot tell what is a good Kydex and what is not, depending on pictures, depending on the company. So when you're buying Kydex online, if you're not going through someone like Raven Concealment or uh, the other big guys on the block and places I have recommended and other people have recommended in the past, you, you're kind of like having a toss up, a coin toss, if you're gonna get a good holster or not. So where I actually came across Battle Ready Holsters was on Instagram. Uh, the owner has a huge Instagram uh, account. That's where he posts all the pictures of the guns and the, and the holsters that he's uh, making. And that's where I came across his holsters. Reached out to him and uh, got this Glock 19, just a standard, I'm gonna bump the camera like a professional, just a standard Glock 19 holster. Got it in Coyote with the Coyote rivets and hardware. I'll go ahead and show you that we're clear and good to go. And then we'll get down to talking about this holster. And one thing you can see with holsters up close is you can see the craftsmanship. You know, is it just slapped together like some holsters on the market? And what I mean by that is you can see on the edges here that this holster just basically, the two pieces have just been riveted together. You can kind of see that you can move it and take it apart a little bit. On this battle ready holster, you don't have that. You have melted together joints all the way around. And you can see right here, there's just a little bit that's not, and that's not a bad thing down towards the barrel. Um, you wanna make sure you have some, uh, he has a drainage hole here, but having that right near where the where that is is not a big deal. But all the way around, you can see that these have been melted together. They've been polished. You know, it's nothing crazy like some places say, oh, we polish it to a sheen and a shine, and I don't really need that. I just wanna have it melted together and you know everything kind of uh, buffed off. And you can see that that's done here. On the back, you can see he has a logo right there, and there's polymer hardware. This isn't Kydex, this is a polymer hardware. You know, he's using really good hardware for this holster. You might see with some other companies that they might use Kydex hardware, and depending on the, uh, the thickness of the hardware they use, you could break and you have a problem. So you don't have that issue here. The other thing I like about this holster is the fact that you have spacing around the outside. Some holsters will be spaced a little bit closer to the outside. You could have that crack and break and then you're gonna have uh, a useless holster. Um, as you can see, like I said, he used Coyote hardware all around. It's just Coyote all around. And comparing it to what I believe is one of the better ones or if not the best company on the market, which is Raven, you can see that you know with Raven, you have the exact same quality. You have that all the way around. You have a little bit of openness down here at the bottom. This is open for drainage and for your light. And then on the sides here, you have you know nice uh, mellowed together and buffed out um, sides. And it has nice plastic hardware or polymer hardware as well. Um, you can see the rivets compared to you know a dominator on the market, again, are not close to the edge. So comparing it to something I believe is the best on the market, like a Raven concealment holster, this really does stand up against it. You know, I went with the low shield. And the cool thing about this is when you put your, you can hear that it snaps into place, which is good. And when you go around it, you can see how close and how nice that it melds right to the gun or it, it sucks into the gun. Uh, you don't have anything, um, you know, open to get debris in there really. You have a little bit of an opening right here, but that's normal. The rest of the gun is nice and sucked into the sides. It has a really good definition. You know, nothing too crazy or over the top, just a really good uh, mold that he did. It's not adjustable as far as the retention goes, but I do like the retention that he put on here. You can see that it snaps into place, which is good. Um, and the retention is what I would call kind of on the medium side. So it's not gonna come out or anything like that when you're rolling around and doing dynamic stuff, you go to courses, uh, et cetera. You're not gonna have this rolling out on you, so I do like that. So as you can see here with this Raven over here, you can see the curve is relatively the same. There's a little bit more curve to the uh, to the Battle Ready holster. Um, you know, just all around a really nice holster. It's a good price, and the cool thing is, you know, you contact uh, the owner over there, you go to the Facebook or you go to Instagram, you contact them, you say, hey, this is what I want extremely customizable and that's the best part about it is 
you don't have to go to a website and just pick out you know four standard colors or whatever you can go as detailed as you want and as you can see the quality is top notch you know i could show you a video of me you know unholstering and shooting with this and whatever but Unlike a lot of other YouTubers, I don't try to make myself feel super important or I have to show you stuff like that. So. so if you guys are looking to be that rainbow unicorn warrior you've always thought you could be, definitely check out Battle Ready Holsters. I think you guys will like them. If uh, you guys do have some Battle Ready Holsters already, go ahead and put a comment down below or better yet make a video about it. Until next time, later.